Hi guys, it's your girl Essie and welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today I'm going to be doing a mini thrift haul. Um, I'm going to be showing you some of the things I've picked up recently at the thrift store and I'm going to be just like doing a little commentary, a little something something um, about them and you know which ones are my favourites and maybe you might even see some of these on my Depop shop soon so let's get into it. So to make it easier on myself, um, in this video I'm just going to insert like clips or photos of the items rather than me trying them on because I just don't have the luxury of space to do that um, and so yeah but hopefully in future videos that won't be such a problem and I'll be able to like show you guys um, the things I picked up and how I style them too so that will definitely be something to look out for in the future okay so the first piece is this cute side bag and honestly when i picked it up i just i grabbed it i didn't even i just saw it and i grabbed it because i was like yes this is definitely something i would have because it's such a simple classic design um and it's really good quality like it's completely leather and it looks really new um and to be honest when i first picked it up i thought it was black and then I got home and I was like, what's going on? And then I realised it's actually navy blue, but to be honest, that doesn't really take away from the beauty of this bag. It's just such a good, um, good trendy piece as well. Um, and it's such good quality that I think like, it's pretty much a staple in like the modern woman's wardrobe. So yeah, this bag definitely, I'd style it with um, almost anything. I style my own. Um, I have one very similar, a black one though. and. Um, that's like my go-to just like going out for brunch going to town just to have a little i don't know meet up with a friend for coffee type bag and yeah so i really really love it okay so the next piece is this like lace cami lacy cami it's like lace and then like silky but this is definitely not silk or satin it's like a polyester-y material but it looks really um really lovely and delicate and honestly I saw this and I left it because I was like mm. but then I just felt like it's just such a pretty piece it's one of the pieces that make me that would make me feel pretty because when I think about um one of my favorite things in my wardrobe which is my robe whenever I wear that I wear that knowing I'm about to pamper myself like it's it's like the same silky and lace fabric material and when I put it on it just makes me feel so like I'm about to give myself a whole spa day I'm about to put face mask on I'm about to like just put some good music and a cup of tea so I went back and picked it up because I was like nah this gives me like take care of yourself vibes you're a queen you know and just having this on with um maybe anything black really just anything like masculine in black with this underneath you've got the right idea you know what i mean okay the next piece it was another like snatch it moment it was like no need for second thoughts no need to like deliberate no need to leave it and come back i saw it and snatched it and that's why i always um when you're thrifting i always emphasize like going through every single rack and going through every single hanger because things like this like obviously a bustier corset top like this it's not gonna like have arms sticking out so you can't kind of just like use your eyes to see you know and it's something that would hide between like two items and then you'd probably miss out because you didn't like go through each individually so if you have time definitely do that but yeah this piece is just I never thought I'd find a bustier, like that's not something I, I never think I'd be lucky enough to find. Um, although it's quite a modern one, this one's by River Island, but it's in such good condition that, um, it, and it's so like, it's like a timeless piece to throw on because it's black and it's got like a shiny satiny um, fabric. And yeah, this is the back, but I'm sure you guys can see that in the photos, but the back of it is um, elasticated. And I just think it looks so nice on anything like this shirt, for instance, I'm wearing. Um, it just looks so chic and I love it. Okay, this next piece is one, arguably, my favourite. Like, out of this haul, there's like two pieces that I absolutely love. And this is one of them. And I'm deliberating on whether or not I should sell this because 
it's just I mean it's just perfect um the photos I took don't even do it justice and I was so frustrated when I was taking photos for Depop I was just like you don't understand like you're not you, the perception is not complete you know like this is like the most perfect fluffy um jumper and it's definitely vintage because um the way it's made i can just tell it doesn't have any tags on it which is really interesting because it's something that like if it had a tag i'd definitely check out the brand um perhaps i'm guessing it may be handmade but it is just so fluffy and so warm that i can't <sighs> can't bear to part with it but it's a really really adorable like fabric feel material and yeah if you see this on my personal instagram don't talk to me don't ask me questions just keep scrolling like it and then keep scrolling okay so when it comes to autumn right my brain just switches to only paying attention to anything brown anything like tan beige you know those kind of autumnal colors like the palette the autumn palette i look out for those things and nothing else and um i started seeing a couple of people styling blazers like this and i was like i want to look out for something like that and see how i'd style it so um i definitely saved like things like this to my pinterest board and so when i was in store and i saw it in the men's section obviously um i just said it just had to be um and it's like really oversized and um one of the ways I love styling anything oversized, um, especially for Depop, I love styling it with like a belt to cinch in the waist. Um, any belt will do, but like the thicker, the better, like the bigger the belt, the better. Um, and if I'm not styling it with a belt, like I like draping it over my shoulders because it kind of drowns me and my figure. So if you're thinking of like wearing blazers like this, a perfect way to style it would be like draped over your shoulder and like a slip dress okay that that would be my stylist advice <laughs> um so yeah this one is the most expensive um, item i picked up out of all of them um i don't want to say my luck has run out with finding cheap leather jackets because i'm not going to just say that and then like my luck actually ran out but um in the last like month i've found like four leather jackets um like really cheap and then i've been able to sell them at like amazing prices like the profit has been profitable i really love this one because it's got like a boxy a boxy cut to it um and it's quite oversized um it's a bit too oversized for me but definitely someone size like 10 would be perfect like perfectly oversized um i definitely style this um, with anything because it's so easy um, with leather like you can start leather with leather or leather with like literally anything else so definitely something to have in your wardrobe as well remember how I said there was two items I absolutely loved in this collection I, I really love like all of them like I'm really proud of the collections I curate because I don't put things in there that I don't love and when I do that I always just feel like ashamed <laughs> to sell them but then when i don't do that and i sell things i absolutely love it's heartbreak sometimes to part with them and that's the case with these like these are the most perfect brogues no they're not brogues they're loafers they're the most perfect loafers i've ever seen in my life but they're size six and i'm a size seven um and the thing is every autumn I want loafers without fail every autumn I absolutely just start craving loafers and when I saw these it was a snatch it was a snatch and go I did not waste it I did not hesitate and the best part is like they were doing a half price sale on bags and shoes so it was it was a beautiful price it was a beautiful price um but unfortunately they'll be going on my depot because they don't fit me but yeah definitely like heartbreak to part with these i would definitely looking out for um a pair like these but they really remind me of the prada ones that are like everywhere right now if you know what i'm talking about then 
you're my people but if you don't i'll put like a photo in the video just so you can see but yeah these are my babies that i'll be giving to someone else to um raise so yeah okay so that's it for now those are all the items um that i'm going to be showing in this video if you liked this video and want to see more hauls comment down below and let me know or give this a thumbs up and do all that stuff youtube is telling you to do um i definitely will be posting if not all but most of these things on my depot so look out for that as well and i'll see you guys in the next one bye